One thing I love about using essential oils is, hi, <laughs> my little one is on the ground by me. Hi. Um, is that I can make things specific to my skin. I've had such a process with skin, hormones, all of that. So it's been really fun to be able to make what I need, how I need it. And one thing I make is toner. If you skip toner, don't. It helps balance your pH. Um, so the recipe that I use, I don't actually create, okay. I don't actually create toner. Like I don't make the constant, you know, the liquid. Um, but I blend things together that I like as a toner that help with breakouts and things like that. So witch hazel is the foundation. This is fill, filled with witch hazel. I use it, my toner, I spray on a reusable cotton round. Um, and what I do is I, so I fill this and then I add essential oils to enhance um, what I need in that way. So taking off all of the stuff and then it leaves, you know, um, skin clearing, um, cleansing essential oils, which I love. Okay, so I already filled it with one that you might be surprised that I use citronella is yes great for bugs um, but since I have four bottles of this I love to use it for skin because it is good for skin and I want to use it year-round if I can so I'm getting use of it by adding it to my toner and I love it you can diffuse it obviously um, it's in purification which purification is another blemish um, amazing oil for blemishes so Citronella, I already put seven drops in. That's about around about how much I put in. And then I'm gonna put tea tree. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. If your skin is sensitive, start with less and then um, add as you figure out what is right for you. You can add whatever oils you want in this. You can add one, it's totally up to you. Um, some people just use witch hazel, which you can do as well. I have normal skin and I still break out, so I'm gonna use stuff that helps with that. And then another one you can use, I'm actually not gonna use this right now because this is empty, but I wanted to show you. Um, lemon is really great for blackheads, great for evening everything out. So I'm gonna start with tea tree and citronella. I just change it up every time I fill this. And then I just put the top on and I mix it and then I'm going to spray it on a reusable cotton round and wipe off all the excess after I have washed my face. Um, it's amazing. It, it still, you'd be surprised at how much it actually still takes off after you wash your face. So go make your own toner. It's super cost effective. I love that if your skin is dry, you can change up the oils. You can do something like patchouli, something like that. I um, just use some light, a light amount of heavy hitter to blemish oils in my toner, but then I have all the nourishing oils in my moisturizer or my um, face wash. I use the charcoal bar soap and I love everything in that way um, or nourishing like for drier skin. So, or the drier um, parts of your skin because it is winter. So but I love this for toner, so thought I'd share.